Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. Hello, hello. Thank you so much for tuning in to Miss Bernie's Way Kroger Grocery Haul. This is a quick grocery haul, the beginning of the week grocery haul, where I just went in and picked up a few veggies that I'm going to be eating um, for lunch and probably a little for dinner or what have you. I may be sharing some of my salads or whatever with you um, if you're interested, you know. I may put them in my shorts or what have you. I'm not doing nothing new. I've tried this over and over before, and I'm trying it again because guess what? I'm not giving up. <laughs> there is another me up under this layer that I'm wearing. So just come on. Come on in and join in on this quick grocery haul. It's something like a healthy grocery haul, but hey. I am not here to judge anybody. I can't tell you what to do with your life, how to do your body, but this is what I'm trying to do for mine. And I want you to come along for my journey, okay? Thank you. Welcome in. So first things first, I picked up the Kroger Steel Cut Oats. This is the 100% grain. These are supposed to be the oats that's good for my body. So that's that's why I have these, okay? Um, I also picked up the Gotham green goddess dressing and dip this right here is uh it has no sugar added and it's uh i don't know i think this is the vegan one okay but anyway it may have a little bit more sodium than what some people want but it, it's pretty good i've had it before all right since I'm lactose intolerant. Another thing I picked up was some more mushrooms. Um, the whole Baby Bella mushrooms. We love them over here. Uh, I also picked up the 50% less uh, sodium, 50% less sugar ketchup. And I have some green grapes. I'm still on the hunt for the grapes with the seed. So I'll probably be looking around in Whole Foods or somewhere else, maybe the farmer's market. I'm going to find them. I also found and purchased some more kale. I enjoy the kale. Yes, kale is life. And I have some tender baby spinach. I picked up two bags. I enjoy the spinach also. And I picked up some watermelon. A little melon in your life. And I picked up some more ginger. The gin I bought a lot of ginger um, maybe two weeks ago. And that's not a good idea. So I'm just going to go in probably twice a week or whatever, make some grocery store runs since it's not that far from me, and try to keep up with my ginger and lemons, you know. And I picked up some asparagus. These are teeny weeny, but... They're good. I like asparagus. I also picked up the Mission Whole Wheat Flatbread. It's supposed to be super soft. And this has a, a good deal of, um, they say no added sugars, high fiber, no artificial colors. But it has the sodium. The sodium content is a little high. It's like three something. So, you know, when you eat something like this, if you eat one or two, make sure whatever you're putting on the inside of it is not a lot of salt you don't have a lot of salt on it that's how i gotta do okay also um i have some cucumber this these are the organic cucumbers and i have some red quinoa and quinoa is good with the beans your peas or however you want to do it some people do different things with their quinoa you can google it and check it out for yourself also um, i have the regular quinoa and I like it. I was introduced to the quinoa a while back. Uh, and I would eat it from time to time. So I just thought I'd scoop it up because I'm really trying to cut back on my rice. Even brown rice for me bloats me. I've been watching the things that's been bloating me even while I've been walking and, you know, doing my little exercises or what have you at home. I still notice how some foods bloat me. Like some people say, well, you know, I can eat anything if I'm exercising. Uh-uh. That, that is not going to work for me. I have to be, uh, I have to do things strategically where it's going to help me, yeah, maintain and, and, you know, keep my muscle mass. 
So anyway, I have the grape tomatoes. I also have the Envy apples, a bag of Envy apples, um, Kroger brand. And I have the 80 Acres Farm Zero Pesticides. This is the Queen City Crisp Artesian, Artesian Lettuces Crowned with Arugula Microgreens. So arugula is really good. Also, I like it for myself. You know, like I say, if you want to do something a little different, you may want to research it before you start. Don't follow nothing that I'm doing because I researched it for my body. So you try to get it for you. You know, get so you can have an understanding and won't say, well, you know, you said that this hand work or that there work and it didn't work for me because you got to get what works for your body. That's how we do that. You know, that way you will know, you know, because I, I, there is no secret. I've been trying to lose weight off and on for a while and I'll fall off the bandwagon and get back on. So now I'm, I'm just planning to stay on the bandwagon. And some of the stuff that you see in here is for my brother because he likes it and he doesn't have the problem that I have. So I make sure I get him what he like. Okay, so I have some Honey Nut Cheerios and that's about it. That's what we have from Kroger's. Okay, so I like uh, salads. And sometimes if I get the salad packs or what have you, I like to warm it up and make it like a stir fry with the tomatoes and the salad and all that stuff. And just put a little dressing on the side with the mushrooms cooked and, you know, the cucumbers, the, they don't have to be cooked. I like my cucumbers, you know, room temperature and it just tastes amazing. So, yeah, try that. And I, I've also been cooking my kale here lately, you know, um, not cooking it to... You don't have any nutrients, but just a little steam and bam, a little steam, a little vinegar and chump chump tastes real good to me. So if I try anything that I think is worth sharing with you guys, I will share it. But other than that, I just tell you to talk to your medical professional, talk to your dietitian, your doctor, your primary care doctor or whomever but make sure if you you know you have questions about um your weight or your diet intake make sure you take it to someone on a higher level because that's what's going to help you in the long run that's what's helping me and that's what's going to make things work a little better for you you know what i'm saying when you try to when we try to do it on our own a lot of times it may work for a little while or it may help for a little while but it you know or if you try to follow somebody else something might come up where it doesn't go just as well as it went for them or it doesn't go you know like what what well, they got different results than I did that's because they probably you know had something else involved um I don't take diet pills I can't take diet pills. I don't do any of that stuff. I'm just totally doing everything organically. Yes. I am not on that kick and I don't knock anyone who has to do that to maintain or have surgery or whatever because we don't know what people go through. Okay. So I don't knock it. I don't knock it. If I could, I would. But um, I just want to throw that in because I'm really working hard and I hate for at the end of the road somebody say, well, she did this or she did that. No, Miss Bernie didn't. I'm doing it just the regular old way. I can do it. It just take a little bit more work <laughs> and time. Okay. So thank you guys uh, for listening to me babble a little bit and coming by and checking out this haul. I will see you in another video. I have two jumpers that I would like to share with you that I picked up from um, a store in my area. And it may be in your area also. So stay tuned for that. All right. Love you guys. If you have not subscribed, what are you waiting on? Come on over to Miss Bernie's Way Place and subscribe because I have a little bit of this and a little bit of that going on over here. Sometimes I have free food uh, hauls that I like to share. And with the free food hauls, they give us extra items. So I share everything that I receive. And sometimes I'm out and about in the park. And I'll share that with you. So stick and stay. Thank you so much. All right. Now I'm out your ear. Love you.